What's up everyone, my name is Larry Snow and in this video we're going to be taking a look at how you can favorite your favorite plugins and have them available to you on any WordPress website you log into. And that's coming up next, so stay tuned. Now to get this set up, you first have to have a WordPress.org account. If you don't already have one, create one. If you do have one, you'll need to sign in. Once you've signed in to WordPress.org, go under the Plugins um, navigation tab here, and then search for all your favorite plugins. Now this is probably gonna take the most time here because uh, you have to search for them, find them all. Uh, maybe you have the URLs, etc. but this is gonna take a little bit of time. And once you find your plugin that you want, I'm over here on Theme My Login. See this little heart here pulsing? It's grayed out. If I click on it, it'll turn red and it'll be added to my favorites. And on WordPress.org, your favorites are under the plugins tab and it's called My Favorites. So here are all my favorites, added them through the years. Now, if I'm gonna log into a website and maybe you're a developer or a designer and you have a set standard of plugins, you know, for security, for safety, for uh, functionality, you have all these set of plugins and you want to use them on every website you build, or maybe you're just using one WordPress website and you were transferring this stuff over to another one and you just wanna install the same plugins, this is where these favorites come in handy. So I'm gonna go into my plugin directory area here on my WordPress website. I'm going to click on add new because this is how you see your favorites. And then right up here, it says favorites. Now, if you click on that, I already have mine loaded in. Uh, but for you, you would just type in whatever your username is here for you, that you created on your WordPress.org account. And it doesn't have to be your username. Say that, uh, if you want to use my favorited plugins, you can use my username and put that in here too. So that's a nifty little trick. Most people don't know that you can do that. And so you just click on that, get favorites, and out they come. And now you can quickly install and activate all of your favorite plugins. Thanks so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed the video, make sure you click the like button because that lets me know that this is something that you're interested in to learn more about. And don't forget to subscribe if you're new to the channel and click that bell icon so that you get notified when a new video goes up on the channel. For more about me, go to larrysnow.me and I'll see you in the next video.